Four races and four nights for USAC, Winchester hosts the ARCA cars, and the Winter Nationals finally roll in the heat of summer. These are your quick hits. What's up everybody, I'm Alan Cavana for Speed Sport. These are your quick hits powered by Lucas Oil. Every week we set up your upcoming weekend of racing. This week we're going from the Midwest all the way to the West Coast. Let's get it started. First up, Indiana Sprint Week wraps up in a big way. The seven race series ends with four races in four nights across the state. The finale is Saturday night at the Quarter Mile Tri-State Speedway. Logan Seavey and Justin Grant are among the winners already. Let's go to Illinois, where there's big money on the line for the World of Outlaws Late Model Series. One of the most popular tracks on the schedule, Fairbury Speedway, hosts the 31st annual Prairie Dirt Classic this weekend. Saturday night's 100 lap feature on the quarter mile will pay $50,000 to win. On the asphalt, NASCAR may be off, but the ARCA series rolls on to one of the most popular short tracks in the country. Ty Gibbs and Corey Heim take their back and forth battle for the series championship to the high banks of Winchester Speedway in Indiana. Gibbs won at the track last season and leads Heim by four points in this year's standings. Finally, it will be worth the wait because the Winter Nationals will finally run at the end of July. Yes, the NHRA is out at Auto Club Raceway at Pomona. If three-time Top Fuel champ Steve Torrance can win, he will become only the sixth driver in Top Fuel history to sweep all three races in the series Western Swing. Torrance has won six of the nine events this season. It's going to be another awesome weekend of racing. For Speed Sport, I'm Alan Kavana. Those were your quick hits powered by Lucas Oil. Lucas Oil, it works. <laughs> quick Hits is now available as a podcast, part of the Speed Sport Podcast Network. To sign up, just go to speedsport.com slash podcasts or your favorite podcasting platform.